Date of Jesus' Birth A 2 BCE Hypothesis Hypothesis Jesus Christ was born on or near June seventeenth, two BCE, at a conjuncture of the planets Jupiter and Venus. Background and presuppositions. Persian astrologers were awaiting a celestial sign to arise over Israel, as predicted by Balaam and for an anointed one, a Messiah, to arrive in Israel as predicted by the prophet Daniel. The star they saw was the planet Jupiter, called the King Star. A jubilee year occurred in 6 BCE, when sold property reverted to its original owner's family. Roman general Publius Sulpicius Quirinius Varus served as Roman legate over Syria and Judah from 7 to 4 BCE, as imperial procurator from 3 to 1 BCE, and as governor of Syria from 4 to 6 CE. Quirinius implemented the first imperial decree requiring everyone to pledge allegiance to Emperor Augustus. King Herod the Great died on the 28th of January, 1 BCE. Jesus was born following the Jubilee year of 6 BCE when family property in Bethlehem reverted back to Mary's husband Joseph. Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth, to Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David. And he sent them to Bethlehem, and going into the house, they saw the child with Mary his mother, and they fell down and worshipped him. Jesus was born during the reign of Herod the Great, who died in January of 1 BCE. In the days of Herod, king of Judea, Joseph froze and took the child and his mother by night, and departed to Egypt and remained there until the death of Herod. Jesus' cousin John, called the Baptist, was conceived after Zechariah his father returned home, six months before Jesus was conceived. When his time of service was ended, he went to his home. After these days his wife Elizabeth conceived. And behold, your relative Elizabeth in her old age has also conceived a son, and this is the sixth month with her. Jesus was born after Emperor Augustus issued a decree in 3 BC requiring that the entire Roman Empire swear fealty to him. In those days a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be registered. The whole Jewish nation took an oath to be faithful to Caesar. Jesus was born while Quirinius Varus was imperial procurator over Syria and Judea between 3 and 2 BCE, administering the oath of fealty to Caesar Augustus. This was the first registration when Quirinius was governing Syria. Quirinius was the first Roman procurator in Judea. Jesus was born between September 3 BCE and May of 2 BCE when there were three conjunctions of the planet Jupiter and a star called Regulus in the night sky. The retrograde motion meant the planet was traveling in a westerly direction in the sky, and so the wise men may have followed it from Persia. By camel it would have taken about three months 
and interestingly this is roughly about the same time Jupiter was traveling in this westward direction. After Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who has been born king of the Jews? For we saw his star when it rose and have come to worship him. Jesus was born on or near June 17, 2 BCE, when there was a conjuncture of the planets Venus and Jupiter in the western sky. We have software that can recreate exactly the night sky as it was at any point in the last several thousand years. We used it to go back to the time when Jesus was born, according to the Bible. Venus and Jupiter became very close in the year 2 BC and they would have appeared to be one bright beacon of light. Mary remained with her about three months and returned to her home. Now the time came for Elizabeth to give birth, and she bore a son. The time came for Mary to give birth. And she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling cloths and laid him in a manger, because there was no place for them in the inn. Deductions John the Baptist was conceived on or near the vernal equinox in March of 3 BCE, and he was born on or near the winter solstice in December of 3 BCE. Jesus Christ was conceived on or near the Feast of Trumpets in September of 3 BCE, and he was born on or around the Feast of Weeks in June of 2 BCE. The details furnished by the Gospels of Matthew and of Luke about the birth of Jesus agree comfortably with extra-biblical history and astronomy.